need to have for rent. Such an average vet. Man, I'm going. Such an average vet. You can't even request who to battle next, so you rap against whoever the fuck they tell you to rap. Yo, what the hell? Yo, oh no. Oh no. Oh no 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 no! Keep going, keep going, sick, keep going. But I asked for this plate because I'm a fan of the great you. The back in the days you spazzing on stage, best flow in battle rap was your lane. But your status changed. Be mad at the game rules. My value and fame grew. I have to replace you. Yo, why is he doing this to him? Like, well, well, why is he doing it? B Magic, what are you doing? Like, what are you doing? Why, why are you still here? Keep Man, going. But I'm paid to. Now I got the same job. Come on, Let me sick. kill him. Come on, sick. Sick. I'm gonna just let it just go, sick. Just fuck it. The staff, right? What? Listen. Yeah. You and fame grew. I have to replace you. I feel bad, but I'm paid to. Now I got the same job as an escape artist. When we got locked in, my hands were tied. Now I gotta use magic to break through. Yo, no, nah, no. Nah. Yeah, let it go. Let it go. Let it go. Let it go. I don't want no intro. I don't want no Showtime SP. I don't want nothing with this. I'm gonna be honest with y'all. To see. The levels that B Magic has went to over the course of his career is is sad. Like it really is sad. Like first of all, salute to every single one of y'all out there that peep this content, whether religiously or passing. Salute to uh, Real Sick URL uh, Jersey. You know what I'm saying? Um, and, and all that and all that. Real Sick a rookie. He's been doing his thing. He's had uh, some dope battles. Him versus Kid Chaos. He's had some more joints. Him. You've seen him. He went to London. He used to be on U Dub. And now he's making his way through the uh, URL ranks. And I will say this, man. Uh, this kid right here. Oh, yeah. <sighs> Chilla Jones. Like, him versus Chilla. One of the better battles of 2020. And I will say this, man. The kid got a bright future, man. Like, he definitely uh, has a bright future. And he definitely is going places. You know what I'm saying? Like, he's going to be one of them ones that we're going to see about. And I must say that uh, the way he whooped. B Magic's ass was biblical. Like B Magic got broken down in so many ways that it was it was it was crazy. Like he broke him down about his style, about him being repetitive, about him choking, about him never excelling. Like it just was so bad that after a point, like it just seems to me that B Magic don't even care no more. And URL P most notably. And you guys, when y'all book these battles, do y'all even care about the artist not caring? Like, I think that they, the artist not even caring anymore should matter. You know what I'm saying? Like, these shouldn't even be really counted as a rookies versus vets. Because now the vets are taking losses by battlers who really don't care. Like, this is stat padding right now. This is almost like padding the stats. Like, he don't deserve this. Real Sick just had Chilla Jones, who was a good Chilla Jones. He didn't play with him. He didn't bring no bullshit. He didn't bring no filler or nothing like that. To get a B Magic, or y'all want to know what happened, I'm going to tell you what happened. He got smoked like a smoke, a, 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 a smoke B Magic. Like, what, what is that for? Like, why, why, would he, why does he have to do that? That's a waste of time. I wouldn't even waste anybody's time. Like, I fuck with B Magic and what he's done over, his, over the course of his career in some regard. But this right here is to the level of sadness that it's sad. Like, it's literally sad what is going on with Magic right now. Like, to see him as a shadow of his former self, like, literally as a shadow of his former self. This don't even make sense no more. It's just whack. Like, in the, all of, and like, he had a battle against Chess, the only person who probably chokes as much as he do, and he beat him 3-0. Like, he 3-0'd him, but since then... Magic just can't get it together. Like when he be rapping his bars, the hesitator, you levitator, you never save you. You just know sooner or later he's gonna get to a point where he's gonna choke. Real sick rapped about that shit too. He was talking about him being hurdle jumpers. We just watching to see when you're gonna like what? Yo, he said something about throwing him off the off a roof, suicide prevention. I'm here to get you off the ledge or off the air. What? I tweeted earlier that I would talk about this battle, but I was not gonna do like a full recap. I was not gonna, I was not fucking gonna uh, have Showtime SP write down rounds, and I'm not doing all of that. I don't, I don't want to waste my time or waste y'all time doing shit like that when it's just not even worth it. I mean, 
What am I doing that for? Like, what am I going to have him? You know, the average bar breakdown, because I've done this before, some of my core audience um, that have been here for years know that I used to, before I met Showtime SP, I used to like write down all the bars for the battles and shit like that. And he's taken, he's done such a great job that, you know, that's what his, that's what his thing is now. So I would say for a really good battle, it may take about an hour of your time to write down everything, like to write down all the bars, all the similes, and then if they're like a super writer, like how, uh, salute the super writer, but not him. But if they're a dynamic writer, like a day, like that shit takes more than an hour. Chilla Jones, more than an hour. Real Sick, more than an hour. A Ward, more, like the guys, the better the pen, the more time it takes to write all that shit out. There's some MCs where you can write out all of that shit in one time, like just straight through. But it's a waste of time when somebody is getting stomped, getting the fucking floor mopped with them, getting a mud hole stomped through them. You know, Store Legacy 10 or whatever that shit was, was not the card for Real Sick to be wasting his time against um, fucking B-Magic. Real Sick need to be on Born Legacy. You need to throw him on Born Legacy? Not, not Born Legacy, I'm bugging. Do you need to get him, throw him on the volume. Fuck it. Volume 6, throw this man on the volume, give him some competition to somebody that he, that's going to bring him some more. You know what I'm saying? I know people talk about the, the rookies versus vets, and oh, you don't want to see him. Give him somebody that's going to be able to bring him some wreck, because so far, he's bigger, no, no homo, he's stronger, he, he's an imposing presence, you know, he's just literally Im imposing his will on these artists right now. Don't even look like he can even be, they're not even competing with him. He's like, like literally punching their heads in. And for the veterans, veteran, a veteran presence can't be going out like this. There's no way in hell. And now it's to a point where B-Magic is like allergic to reactions. Like if he gets a reaction, he's going to choke. He'll be rapping his own material, get a dope reaction for some shit he said, and will choke. Like, he said some shit like, uh, like, like, you and me, we both, like, he, he was talking about, the, you know, him being Indian and shit like that, and he was, like, using, like, uh, Jalalabad, uh, 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 talking about Osama and shit like that. People from Afghanistan and Indians are two totally different, two totally different sides of the world, but that's another story. So... He had a line about we both used to sell gas to niggas, you know what I'm saying? Like, because, you know, he was saying that Real Sick worked at the gas station and shit. And, you know, he was saying that he used to sell gas. And he had a couple of other joints. And then, like, he choked in. He got through his first. Choke stumbled in his second. Choked in his second. Choked in his third. It was fucking crazy, man. I, I literally, after the first round, I'm watching this shit. I'm like, bro, mm -mm. nope. Nope, nope, nope. I, I just thought it was a waste of time. So I'm just like, you know, I, I hope the best for the up and coming MCs, but let's be for real. This is not it. No, yeah, mm -mm, not it. Not, not it. I, I'm sorry. Y'all want to know what happened? I'm going to tell you what happened. B got smoked again. Like, again. This is not even the first time. This is double L, like LL, like super. And he gets smoked. And I can see if it happened every now and then. You know what I'm saying? Like every now and then you lose a battle. B-Magic is losing every now, then, now, again, now, now, now. It's just every fucking battle. Like if Geechee got every fucking bar, this nigga uh, <laughs> B-Magic loses every fucking battle. And it's just sickening at this point. I know they was using him as card filler last year. Had him against Jerry West. Had him against T-Top on the quarantine shit. Had him, but he's literally card filler. That's what they do nowadays. If you got a little bit of a name left and they can still muster a little bit up out of you, they'll use you as card filler to help build a lot of the newer guys. But real sick is past that. Kid Chaos is past that. Easy to Block Captain is past that. Fucking Luke Castro is past that. Yo, there's so many. This class is deep. Fonz is past that. Yo, they got a really, really, really deep, deep, deep number of, of dudes in this class right here. I ain't gonna lie, in the beginning I was like, man, I need to see more, I need to see more. But as the year ends off, I've seen enough. I have seen enough. These guys are not playing, and they're gonna be here for a while. It's gonna be hard. <laughs> These rookies write very well. 
They don't play. Kid Chaos just went crazy against Danger Zone. Uh, Fonz just went crazy versus Av. Uh, and it's like, even if, even if you get a win on them, it ain't going to be an easy one. These guys are not getting smoked. Easy to block captain. Got T-Top coming up. Easy to block captain been wilding in his joints. Are you crazy? Like, if you go back and watch some of the Easy to block captain's past joints before he got there, he was bugging. But real sick, pen-wise, up there. Up there. Up there. Where the money resides, he's ready to go. You got to – he got the – I think his next look should be against a name. I don't want to start going saying this person, that person, this person, that person. He, I mean, he already had a name in Chilla. Did very well versus him, but we need to keep him. Uh, we need to keep him heavily, gamefully employed, because uh, this he's not playing. He's not playing. And B Magic, I, I just don't know, man. I, I'm sorry. I, you know what? I'm gonna go ahead and grab my things, man, and walk away, because I, I just don't know. Like, I, I don't know what's going on with you, Magic. Uh, Career was, was not too bad. He was one of the leaders of the St. Louis movement and all of that. St. Louis truest, smooth through with you, aluminum foil, move through you and the you and the yours. And you. It's the flow, though. You gotta, you, your flow is mad dated, dog. You still rapping like it's 2007. Why are you still rapping like that? I'm out.